on the beach. Hi, Paul, your game. It's all good, eh? Yeah, something like that. This is Paul. This is Paul's dream. And this is the game yeah, on the table. The beaches. Right, oh, the turn two. Gentlemen. Oh, listen up. Paul's talking. Just so you know, dive in the bag. Every dive pulled is three units. Apart from the beaches for the first three turns, they get six units. After that, back to Braden. If they activate a unit on the beach, it becomes one unit. They can't use the six unit rule. This dice in here, different colours. German, allied, <laughs> random event, tipping dice, ends the turn, and two aircraft dice. Germans get plane on a roll of a one. The allies get them on two, three, four, five, and six. One pass only. Yep. And they're only strafing runs, no bombs. Hopefully you all know the rules, because I don't. I've got to say, Gary. 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 There are several people that know the rules, but not to be alone. No. Please, sir. I know the rules. You're a judge. Gary knows his own rules. Yeah, I'd like to be a trick. You've never seen that. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know cricket. Can't play it. What was it? Do you know where we know if they landed? You can hear them or not? We've got a thought. Need to see. You need to see. You need to see. You need to see. You need to see. Sorry, did I not tell you that before you saw it? Did I not tell you that before you saw it? No, I ate from the dice. It's a little four. You've got to tell us. Five. Don't hear them. You get to do that each time. Each time, next turn. Five, six. Oh, okay. I'm going to say, I'm right. Unless they can't get to me. Kill the allies. Uh -huh. Yeah. After turn, they turn right to the And they arrive. And we were looking up. This. Yeah. Your Germans are here. They are all filleted in the buildings. Right, okay. You could. You could. You could. You could. You could. You could. You that's about all I know. Oh, yeah, you won't it's never worth it. Yes, it? yes uh, I'm the German in this game. Yeah. And my objective is to stop the partisans from taking the submarine, which has got classified documents on, and also trying to take the harbour for the Allies. And what part is this? This is... Um, do you remember in the film The Longest Day where they had the French man who was coming up? Yep. They, towards the casino? Yeah. Well, the casino was over there in the distance, and the, the French commandos, the French population, have risen up against the Germans because the French commandos have landed part of the D Day. And so um, I'm going to be fighting the French partisans. Enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, it's interesting. I'm going to have a so are you partisans? Yeah. Ah. Right. Okay. If you see there, we've got the general, the head of the Gestapo, and <laughs> Rommel. They're all going to be trying to escape. Yeah, they're trying to avoid the war. That's why I'm saying that. Yeah. <laughs> you're doing you're playing the French. I am playing the French. Yeah. Excellent. And do you have any idea what you're doing? A little bit. A little bit of an idea what I'm doing. Fantastic. I've got a plan. It's not going to work. I'm going to raise the white flag and run away. Okay. That's the way to do it. Okay. Well, yeah, sounds interesting. We did American player. No, I'm not American. I am. Oh, right. Oh, I'm not. Uh, yeah. Uh, um, this one. Sword. Sword. I'm on sword. Yeah. You want to do your... Put your dice down where you're going to land. You're panicking me now. I'll tell you, if you've got it, every two or three units put a landing craft. So you just yeah. Got them a lot. yeah, and then we'll move all the trays off and then we've got it. Right. I haven't... It's a big table. The facing for the Germans, they can come on one per turn. They can land one per turn, yeah? 
It's like two inches. Yeah, you know, no, is it? Is it? No, I follow you. You're, yeah, you're quite tight. It's still a strong arm there. Bring that a second. Oh, it's you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute, look. Oh, no. I'm sure I've got the We've got the tank lander, or well, at least the front half of it. Is that the one you were printing? Yeah, yeah. attempting to. It was, just, it was a small scale model that blew up. But yeah, it just about fits off. Yeah, that would not be yeah. on the edge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 so what happens when we go? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
uh, onto St. Mericles. Uh, the Germans are in occupation of St. Mericles. There's some people there trying to leave. Uh, obviously, now the invasion started, the refugees are clogging the road. Um, but the paratroopers are on the outskirts and they are moving in. There they are, coming through the streets, heading towards St. Mericles. Onto the U boat pen. The French countryside and towns have risen up and um, they've started to attack. The German positions um, threatening the U-boat pen and the dock. Um, so the French resistance are doing their best to try and attack the Germans. The Germans are in a good position at the moment though and are causing lots of casualties against the French, which are finding it difficult to get going. Obviously resistance fighters aren't quite as good as, as uh, some troops. So how many turns is that now? It's the seventh oh, turn. It's the seventh five. turn. So it's seventh thick turn. Thick yeah. Yeah. The Allies are actually starting to break through in certain places now. Even though, even though Dean's done his best to lose, he's actually managing to accidentally break through by default. Gary's managed to select the only bit of the battle where there's no Allies. I look at that angry face again, that was actually a good bit. Yeah. <laughs> I can't help it if I've been defending properly and you've allowed him to get through your lines. A bit of interference there, anyway. I'll try and patch a bit of music over them. Thanks. The Allies are supposed to win. Can't help it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'll play most. He's crossed out some artillery. He's crossed the ones he got shot. Yeah, Americans largely get the stuff on the beach. Withering fire from the Germans up here. The breach. Dean's accidentally crashed the tank through. Doing his best to lose. I can't see what they're doing. 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 I can't see what they're not quite. Uh, machine uh, gun on it. Ah, there's still somebody on there, is there? Yeah. That's far as she got, Brad. Hmm? That is as far as she got. I thought I would have. I was just running, it'd be alright, but I had to stop and shoot things. <laughs> That's How rude. Yeah. yeah. That's because you thought you was holding that bit, that's why I had all the reserves, wasn't it? The Yanks are forming up to storm the church. That unit there is actually inside the church. And they're just getting the numbers up so they're actually, they've got a shot at taking it when they go for it. Okay. So is that all you've got left now to hold it? Or? This is it, everything's now in. Involved. I've got the numbers, but the armoured cars and the tank are proving a problem. Yeah. I've got that on the beach, same thing. Oh. See, it's great, isn't it? Yeah, it really catches it nicely. Yeah. Distracted him with the tags. Probably from the trip. Quite the way up to the gun. Broken through. Smash down against one of them. Bring more and more. We don't get replaced. We're starting to take the base now. Liberate that Every time I kill you, all the gold on board. Yeah. yeah. There's, a lot of French, there's a lot of French people living in France, aren't there? You know, you're yeah, worried yeah. about that sort of shit, I suppose. <laughs> Still holding on, mate. Rods. We will carry on. We've got a couple of boats ready just in case we have to retreat. Well, at least the Allies are well fed. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we come to the end of the longest day, it really was a good game. As you can see there on Sword Beach, the British have tried their best but have only breached the German entrenchments in one place. 
The Germans managed to throw them back uh, with the use of uh, reinforcements at the right time. And the British really did find it hard to get off the beach, so there's such withering fire on them that they really did struggle. Um, but it was it was good. Uh, moving up the beach, Juno, uh, they did get further. They're almost on the on the outskirts of the German entrenchments, but they still didn't manage to penetrate. And then towards the end um, of the of their beach, they did manage to get up, and you can see there that the whole bunk had been destroyed, and there was a breach in the German lines, which would obviously lead to the Germans retreating. The German trenches are emptying out. Look, I've been killed, or or they've been um, all run away. Uh, or surrendered, and the Americans have managed to push through the Rangers leading the way um, by down there. Andy's stalwart defence uh, not quite paying off in the end, uh, there was just too much, too many overworking pods for him to fight. And you can see there what the Americans had to do, they took horrendous casualties, uh, which you know, they did in real life. So, um, moving on to Pegasus Bridge, the paratroopers have managed to take the town, starting to go through the town now, pushing back, taking out some of the Neville workers. And you can see there they've captured the bridge, gone all the way through, and they're starting to uh, go beyond. So the paratroopers took the day and took Pegasus Bridge, um, led by Brad against Stu, who tried his best to do a stalwart defence. So Meriglis, um, much the same, same story. The, British, the American paratroopers have taken the church area, taken the town, put loads of pressure on the Germans. The Germans are just hanging on the edge, but again the artillery batteries are under pressure. And at the U-boat pen, the French have pushed the Germans back. Frank is now preparing to board his U-boat and leave for Argentina. And the French are taking reprisals for all the horrible things the Germans have been doing to them for the last few years. And so, Paul, what did you think of the day? Do you think it worked out well? I have no idea. No idea. It was great where everyone was. So that's the end of the game, really. Good game, enjoyable. Well, a lot of people put a lot of effort in, so see you next time.